2020 AFL trade period came to an end on Thursday night, with plenty of deals being finalised across the league. The Crows could not reach an agreement with the Giants to trade 20-year-old Jackson Haitley, but Adelaide List manager Justin Reid reiterated on Friday that the club is committed to the young midfielder. Obviously, we went in good faith to obviously try and get a deal done with GWS, but it seems like time ran out at the end and we'll now pursue, uh, I guess, Jackson through the pre-season draft uh, in December. Adelaide strengthened their draft hand as the club continues to progress with its list rejuvenation strategy. As of next Monday, we'll go into, I guess, that draft preparation, but as of tomorrow, we can still move picks around. So there's, a, I guess, a trade pick period that we can work from tomorrow up until the Monday before the draft. So. Obviously, we've still got some picks sitting there that we can do some work with either for this year or into the future. Um, and we'll go into the draft with anywhere from three to five picks. So we'll work through that with list management and recruiting over the next you know, fortnight or so. On Friday afternoon, Adelaide informed Jordan Gallucci, Miles Paholke and Ben Crocker that their contracts would not be renewed for next season, while veteran David McKay will play on after signing a one-year extension. It's always a challenging time when you're having those conversations, but I guess from a list management perspective, you know, with Jordy and Miles that have been here four years and just haven't quite got to the level, unfortunately, and, and Croc is, is a super individual. He came over the last 12 months and gave some great energy to the group, but again, uh, with list sizes and the decisions we need to make around the draft and the rookie list. Um, some of that's having impact on those decisions as well. We're always keen to keep Dave around, just him as an individual to be around the young guys and what he brings to the group and, and the footy he's played in the last few years. He really deserved another year. The 2020 national and pre-season drafts will be held in December. Stay tuned to afc.com.au for all your draft news.